In this video, we will be talking about some of the data distribution plots in MATLAB. Specifically, we will talk about histograms, pie charts, and heat maps. We can use these plots as a way of displaying data. Let's start off with histograms. A histogram is a visual interpretation of numerical data by showing the number of data points that fall within a specified range of values. Let's now switch to MATLAB and open out a new live script. We will first import the data that will be used to make the distribution plots. To create the categorical histogram, we will use the file outages.csv. Let's read the file as a table. The outages file contains data representing electrical utility outages in the United States. The file contains six columns, region, outage time, loss, customers, restoration time, and cause. Each column contains different kinds of data types. There's categorical, floating point numeric, or date time. We will use the format option to specify the kind of data each column contains. We will now index into the first few rows of data to see the variables. Let's now plot a categorical histogram of the cause variable. Let's specify cause of outage on the x-axis, frequency on the y-axis, and specify a title to the plot to make it easy to read. We can also change the appearance of the histogram. Face color lets us change the histogram bar color by specifying some common colors by name. The display order option allows us to sort the bins. For example, let's sort the bins from the largest to smallest and change the color of the histogram to red. Pie charts show the relative size of each value in relation to the whole. We will now index into the first five rows of data from the outages file. Let's now extract the loss column from the table. We will now plot the pie chart of the loss and label the slices using the pie function. We can offset slices from the pie. Explode is a vector or matrix of zeros and non-zeros that correspond to loss. Offset the second and the fourth pie slices by setting the corresponding explode elements to 1. We can also compare two pie charts. We can create a 1 by 2 tile chart layout and display two pie charts that each have a title. Then display the shared legend in the E style of the layout. A heat map is a graphical representation of data where values are depicted by color. Heat maps make it easy to visualize complex data and understand it at a glance. We will use the heat map function with region on the x axis and cause on the y axis to create a heat map that shows different regions and different outage causes. Each cell will show how many times each region experienced a power outage due to a particular cause. With 2021A of MATLAB, the next time you want to create a plot, use the live task for an easy and interactive experience. First load the file Patience. To open the task, either select Create Plot from the Task tab or type Visualize in a code block. When the task opens up, select the plot that you want, select age as the x variable and diastolic as the y variable in the select data section. You will now see the scatter plot to your right. You can also customize the visualization, select marker symbol from the drop down and go ahead and select the marker that you want. The scatter plot now shows the updated symbols. This task automatically generates MATLAB code as well. If you want to learn more about the different types of MATLAB plots and the examples that we used in this video, feel free to go through the links in the description.